Hey everyone, I'm back with another tutorial. This one is just more of a smoky brown 1920s owl shaped eye <laughs> with kind of mod looking liner because it's a little bit thicker than I would normally do. It was kind of a mishap when I did the liner. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoy. My skin's already been moisturized. I'm gonna go right in with foundation using Chanel's Pro Lumiere. The color is number 10, Nude. first color I'm going in with is a matte color and it is called Tempting, which is kind of a bronzy gold color. To apply it, I'm going to use a 239 flat shader brush. Now I'm going to take a 222 blending brush. I'm going to start to blend this outside edge of color. Now this is going to be a rounded shape, but I'm also going to blend it up to the eyebrow, the inner corner, so it's more, going to be more of a 1920 shaped eye as opposed to bringing the color out to the side of the eye. If you already have really deep set eyes, this is probably not a very good look for you, but if you can work it out, go ahead. Back in with that color, packing it back on. Now I'm taking that 239 and I'm running it underneath the lower lashes. Don't worry, um, we're going to bring this. A little bit lower than we normally would so it's going to be a very rounded type of eye. Now I'm going to take my 227, my magic eraser, and I'm just going to buff that outside line just to make it a little bit more hazy and not so stark looking. The next step for our look, taking Bare Study from MAC on a angled synthetic brush. Get some on there and tap off a little bit on your back of your hand. And I'm going to put it into this inner corner of the eye. And this is just going to help open up the eye a little bit because what we've done is Putting that shadow so close to the nose, it's going to make the eyes appear a little bit smaller and closer set together, and this is going to counteract that just a little bit. If you have really close together eyes, this is probably not an ideal look for you, but you know, you can wear whatever you want, whatever makes you happy. I'm just going to take that bare study on my pinky and put it underneath the brow. And 
that will open up the eye as well. Now I'm going to use concealer, just all my bright eyes. This will help clean out this outside edge of color. I don't want it winged out, I want it very rounded. To help marry the Bare Study paint pot and the eyeshadow, I'm going to go in with Brulee from MAC, which is a little bit darker than my skin tone just on a 224 brush and just go over that line. Just to subtly hide that line of demarcation. Now I think we need some eyeliner. I'm going to take Smolder Eye Coal from MAC. And I'm going to take a MAC 214, smudge that along the lash line. I'm going to take that 214 and some carbon and go right underneath my lower lash line. Just pressing the shadow in between the lashes. I think this look calls for liquid eyeliner as well. I'm going to use L'Oreal Paris Carbon Black Liner. This is the one with the felt tip applicator, which I'm really loving at the moment. Makes it so easy to apply. real thick line going on now. It's more of a 1960s liner because it's really thick in the middle. Mascara I'm going to use is Cargo Super Size in black. Now for lipstick, I'm going to use, which color is this? This is NYX Ice Latte, that color. So you can see I depotted my lipsticks and put them into little pill containers. That way it's easier for me to see the colors and make a selection based on what the look is. It's just a little bit easier. I'm using, um, this is Sigma 194 concealer brush. I think I am done. I hope you guys enjoyed.